Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Harald Drak and we are playing Mount Blade Warband Viking Conquest Reforged Edition as Balder Thorgrimson. Welcome to the Kingdom of Baldur's Dale. We're under attack over here in our castle of Care Ragged. And it's my fault, I guess, because, um, yeah, I took the garrison out of this. I only left a skeleton crew in there and now it is perceived uh, as weak by every enemy lord that is running around and they are all marching towards this place. And Madog Map Cadell isn't very strong either, so we just have to do the defense. Oh, he broke off the siege. Interesting. Well, I'm Baldur Thorgrimson. He's only suspicious, but well, surrender or die. If you come into my lands and are coming to annoy me, you're just gonna get it. <coughs> I stand to gain 23 renown from this battle, that's interesting. I don't think that is quite um, appropriate, but oh well. So I have 126 Huskars, 47 spearmen. At some point I should put the spearmen into the Huskars because it is a bit of a mood point. Well, my companions are doing are doing well, I'd say. Kill two, wounded four. I only lost one guy. I think the shields on their backs are doing are doing well for them. I definitely want my skirmishers up there. Uh, maybe I should march in formation, but oh well, I'm gonna deal with it. Nos companion was killed. This should be fine. Bring up the skirmishers. <coughs> so they seem to have been reinforced. Well, we're gonna we're gonna form a shield wall, nonetheless. So we're gonna have them stand closer. We're gonna have these guys form a shield wall, we're gonna move them out. We'll also have them stand closer. We're gonna put the house calls up here. Put the spearmen back. And then we'll see how this goes. Uh, my skirmishers, I'm gonna put up here. This is a good position for you. And I'm going to see if this doesn't work better. It should. Still having some people killed. Well, it doesn't look like it is as many. Skirmish is making their way up there. So now that all the spearmen are here. Gonna uh, put them over there to the side. New enemies have arrived. Interesting. So we're gonna put the Haskells forward and attack the infantry division. And we're gonna send our spearmen against the enemy um, skirmishers. How's it going? 110 enemies. I'd say it's going well. The, the leader is down. Okay, the house calls are destroying after finishing off their infantry. Go and attack their skirmishers. 
think we can go in all out attack mode now. So charge everyone. Just charge. And I'm gonna I'm gonna join the fray as well. Just yeah, let's just finish these assholes. <clears throat> I mean, I shouldn't, I shouldn't curse so much, but I'm, I'm really annoyed that they are all at war with me. Yeah, okay. A bowman got this guy. Oh well, why not? And we won! Very nice. How many did we lose? 26. Oh. And he is my prisoner. Welcome to my dungeon. Can look forward to it. You come to my land. You have to prepare to be taken prisoner. I'm gonna throw him into the dungeon. And that's gonna be good. So let's level, let's level you up. Do I need another standard bearer? Yeah, why not? Standard bearers are good. Okay, and let's share the loot. We gained a war trophy, didn't we? Yeah, we gained one. Let's see, we only have one battle trophy in this. That's a bit of a shame. And uh, not much loot that is really valuable. So I'm gonna take some of it to recoup my losses. Maybe even a bit more. Like that, okay. <coughs> I mean, I, I get 200 Peningas for this, but what am I gonna do with 200 Peningas? I did not get any troops out of this, but at least I can promote some people. Um, another standard bearer, why not? And then let's fill up our spearmen there. I might just... Um, these guys are Huskals. These guys are Huskals. Well, these guys are gonna join the Huskals as well. Skirmishers, Huskals. You're gonna join the Huskals. So that's fine, I shouldn't have any more spearmen. It's a bit unwieldy to command both groups. I'd rather only have one. Okay, so we defended Kerr Ragged successfully. Bjorn Ironside is, is coming with me. And now we're gonna go and Oh, 51 Norse warrior archers. I want these guys, come on. Uh, we're not killing if you join me. 15,000, don't have enough money. Oh, you you want to fight me? <laughs> That's laughable. But it's, it's a bit bad that I don't have the money to recruit these guys. It would be really nice to get them. 51 uh, warrior archers would be... A very welcome addition to our party. Let's see if these Northmen haven't acquired some more funds. Hello. Let's sell our spoils. Yeah, they have 3,000 at least, so I'm gonna sell some of this cheap crap. They're really paying top dollar for these things. Yeah, just pay what you can afford. I really don't have the, the money to do anything, so. Oh yeah, okay, 2,000, I'm gonna take it. I'm, I'm starved for money at the moment, so that's not good. Um, I I won't need you for some time, so do as you want. I have to I have to get money, and then we're gonna attack um, Cthulhu's. Stop Echo Map Rune from annoying me. Uh, Rigmanant has been raided. Trev Gorb. Trev Gorb over here. Oh well. We'll live with it. They are the Northmen. I wonder, could I not could I not join them? Yeah. Now Bjorn is just gonna destroy them because I herded them towards his army. That's bad. Oh well. Well they're gonna run. Cool. Uh, 
Um, yeah, let's recruit more volunteers. Another couple of bowmen. Aidenham East is um, there as well. 11 freeholders, that's gonna be good. So we're gonna take these these hearth mothers. I'll give you four of these again. And I definitely want to throw you in the dungeon so you don't run away. Let's go to the meat hall. So these guys to the ransom broker. That's going to give me some money. Yeah. Good. Do you have an old captain and a widow? Do only have one battle trophy, so I'm just going to use that. I'm not going to go through the hassle of... Um, Leaving all my men out and all that. So. Let's throw that war trophy in here. We do have a lot of them by now. I really shouldn't lose um, this place as well. That would be bad. Oh, there are more lords. Send and Web Sindruin, really? You want to join me? Correct my wrath. Ah, yeah, he, he already uh, joined me before. Relation 15 is welcoming. Don't really have the money to give you stuff, do I? Well, can do that. Don't have enough money to do more. And you? I'm just going to let you stand around here for a bit. Cinemap Syndruin. Interesting that he would join me. I thought he was in my dungeon, wasn't he? Oh well. Come on, done. Let's leave. I'm gonna move to Aidenham East and Din Bear, collect my my recruits from these places, and then we're gonna sail northwards to another Northman Longport. No one wants to join me. Why don't you wanna join me? I'm I'm your friend. Don't have money to build anything. Oh, Aslan Gibson is hanging out here in my castle. So let's let's get that one recruit. Can't build anything in here either. Papillas are still opposed to me. Why though? I'm such a nice lord. I do have 4,000 with me. Some soldiers are ready to upgrade. Okay. So these freeholders, we can train them a bit faster now. That's certainly good. Let's sail from here. Yeah, that's fine, I guess. I'm gonna sail from here. Sail from port. I would have liked more money, but oh well. And I really have to really have to recruit these guys as well. Populace is hostile towards me. That's a shame. Let's sail from port again. There is a Renegades camp and a Northman Longport up there. And at both places I can sell some some stuff. There's the Northman Longport. I need the money. Okay, Ragged has been besieged uh, by another asshole. Holy crap. I can't catch a break. Maybe I should just let them take it, then retake it with a proper garrison and spare myself the tedium of running there always. That is a nice group that we might be able to take. 4,700, that's not much. Well, I'm gonna, go, gonna get good money for these things as well, so I'm just gonna sell the crap that I got. <clears throat> Hmm, that stuff is rather valuable. 
of the smelling chicken <laughs> and the smelling pork and the smelling beef. Okay then. So that didn't go too well. Let's move back to the ships. Uh, we have to move into the south. And defend our place. Let's sail to Edinburgh. People are pissed that they have to spend the night in the sea, at the sea. Deal with it, is what I can tell you. Deal with it. More recruits, good. And more of these freeholders socket. I think I can do it faster than my wife can. So I'm gonna take more of these freeholders with me into battle. Now that most of my guys have reached um, level 19, they are certainly faster. So let's leave and let's move again to Karagat. Chef Karolog has been looted. It's these archers that I couldn't buy. Yeah, Bjorn Ironside has this. He's got this. Norwegian trader, Christian clergy. Fuck off, get out of my land. That's Sidrock the Young. Karagat is still under siege. It's not. It's not under attack. I think we should be able to to take this. 1500 Peningas for Alderman Eel here. All right then, have him. We gain some money. Now I should be able to recruit some people. That's Halfton Rockinson. I think this is his village. Uh, more people level up. Oh. Now things are going really fast. <clears throat> I like it. So these freeholders, I'm I'm again I'm going I'm gonna put them into spearmen just so they don't get to the front where they where they don't belong. Crap. Now they are attacking this place. Hmm, Madoc Mapkadel does have 160 men now. That's good. That's very good. So we're gonna help Madoc Mapkadel. Let's charge the enemy. Ah, it's a field battle. It seems like Madoc Mapkadel was trying to flee. Definitely gonna put my spearmen over there. The other guys can charge. Come on, get out of my way, you. What are you? You look like a spearman. Uh, you're a Norse companion. Okay, that's fine. And my skirmishers, I want them to follow me. The other guys can, can run in. At least I do have some standard bearers now. That's good. So my my bodyguards aren't doing. Oh yeah, they're doing some work over there. They are just 16 against a lot of enemies, but still. Oh yeah, Madoc Macadil does have some horsemen. It's not good that the garrison is growing so slowly. We really need to get that up. But I can't, I can't influence the garrison growth anymore. Madoc Macquarell has to do that. At least he has raised a sizable army again, so that he's able to defend his own castle. Maybe he'll wants wants his own army first, and then he is going to go after the garrison. That would be good. So my bodyguards are getting knocked out, but there's still nine of them left, hacking away at the enemy. I think they're doing a pretty good job, especially now with their shields on the back, they can't be so uh, felled so easily. You can see one over here. Maybe I should even take their throwing weapons, just only give them swords. 
Well, I don't think so. I think this works pretty well. So the spearman, I want you over here and I want you to stand a bit closer. I'm gonna ride into this. I think this battle should be over soonish. shame that we are fighting the Norsemen. If I were to kill off um, the Kingdom of Lathland, I would free a couple of uh, lords with Norse troops. Up until this point I've mainly gotten the, um, the old Klug lords who really hate me. So it's costing me a lot of money to get them to a point where we can really use them. Won this battle fair and square, so that's good. And he's happy that I turned up. <laughs> I turned up just in time. I will not forget your help. Together we will make the foe learn to fear our names and to quail at our coming. Yeah, yeah. And we're having some prisoners here. Well, the um, the priests. I'm gonna let. Um, I'm gonna let go free. I'm not interested in in holding priests uh, prisoner. At least not priests of our own side. Priests of the enemy, I got no problem with that. Okay, so yeah, I'm, go I'm gonna take most of this crap. I still need money. All right, more soldiers are ready to upgrade. One more Norse Companion, and the Norse Companion are, increase, are going to increase our amount of Norse Veterans, uh, if you want to have a look at them. They're level 26, so I need to get my troops, uh, my Companions to level 27 to be able to promote them to Huskals. So level 27 is our end goal. Being able to level these up to Veterans would also be pretty good, so we need to get to level 24 for that. It's not impossible, it's just going to take some time. Most of them just reached level 19, but oh well. How is Kerregat? Only 17 men still. But, well, at least Madog Map Cadell managed to, managed to defend this. I don't think he would have been able to, to defend it by himself, but we prevented him from losing more men, I think. Oh, I do have enough men now to... Oh yeah. Kill the Christian clergy. I like that. You're doing well. Meet again. Okay, he doesn't like me very much. Okay, that's too bad. That's just too bad. So we do have a trader. Where are these? Where are these um, bowmen? They have, they do have five thousand again. So no, I'm, I'm not gonna sell the the um, high value crap. I'm gonna sell these things. They're paying incredibly good prices for these. Not sure why. Maybe they're just starved for equipment. I'm gonna reclaim that. Yeah, let's reclaim that as well. That is fine. Wait, who are you? Alvin Rickstick. Aren't you the one that likes me? Maybe not. Come on, I only want to talk with you. How rude. Well, Connor McDuin. No, not 700. You have to pay at least a thousand to get your lord back. No, he doesn't like me. Okay, back my leave. So we're now we're now able to train these guys up really quickly. I like it. Um, another standard bearer. Why not? I think I'm gonna. Have, I want to have at least let's say six or seven standard bearers. I want to go to a robber's den. Sell my spoils. Oh yeah, they have ten thousand. 
I mean, I really do want to get rid of some of these things. So the helm, helm with the mail, so that cracked complete helm. Yeah, that's fine. That's good actually. Yeah, just pay what you can. Hmm. Looks a bit odd. This robber's den thing, but oh well. Let's go to Babenberg. So I can get eight Norse freeholders from this place. Populace is acceptive towards me. Let's go to the meat hall. And we do have a ransom broker here, that's good. Sell all the prisoners I have for another 3,000. Aquitanian skirmisher, that's not gonna happen. But I, well, nah, I can't, I can't, can't spare the 1,000. I wonder how much traveling to Edinburgh is gonna cost me. Oh, I can't travel because I'm the marshal. That's not good. But we're not on campaign currently. Um, all right then, we have to live with it. Okay, procession of beggars. Well, have, have 200 and leave me in peace. Heaven, heaven, north. Beggars are blessing my name. Oh yeah, nice. Eight freedmen. The populace does like me, interestingly enough. And Aiden and West is being looted again. Oh yeah. Why does he not like me? Ah oh, yeah, because I haven't given him any any land, so he's he's pissed that he's not getting any spoils. I have to bring you guys up. And we're gonna make some freeholders out of you. And bam. Why does the population of Bam not like me? This has been my village at a at a point in time. Well, they're indifferent, so uh, they're not gonna join me, so whatever. Um, trader, this has been looted. I wonder if I can sell something again to this long port. Maybe they have gotten some more money. Yeah, 7,000. That's actually enough to sell this Lorica. Good. So we've, we're slowly getting rid of these things. I would like to recruit some more Northmen. Populace is very hostile towards me, so that's not gonna happen. I need Cthulhu's. Aiden and West might um, regale me with some more troops. Eight more freedmen, that's fine. I mean, they're not very high level, but I can take care of that myself. So. Let's move to Edinburgh. So, Garrick Mapwrath is really pissed that he's not getting any fief. Ten Norse spearmen are willing to follow me. That's good. We're gonna take these hearth mothers um, as our own. Yeah, I'm, I'm faster now in leveling these up than my own people are, which is which is just fine. And we're up at 55,000, so we're not completely starved for money anymore. I am going to... to put my war trophy in here. Battle trophies... I'm gonna do that too for now. Just wanna collect some more. For you. Cinemap syndrome. Well, you're angry. You're also not crazy. I'm gonna take you, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna trust you too much. I would be honored to accept your pledge. You, 
You really want to say that to your liege, you asshole. I'm gonna give him a huge amount of money. What is that? I don't have enough money. Script error. Okay. Now, um, Cinemap Syndrome needs needs a place that he can hold. Um, so, let's talk about affairs of the state. I'm gonna grant one of my wrestlers a thief. Now, what do I have unassigned? I have Trev Ragged unassigned. So, we can give that to... Ah, uh, yeah, Rune Mac Art Girl did get a fort and a village. If you give them, um, if you give them the castle directly, they also get the village belonging to the castle, which is actually not what I want. I'm gonna give this guy that place. Oh, Rune Map Art Girl likes it. If I give Gerich Map or something. So I have to defer the appointment of uh, the castles. Strengthen our kingdom's unity. Bjorn Ironside doesn't like any of these old clued assholes, I guess. I like that idea. Okay. Now. Want to address your quarrel. Um, settle your differences. Okay. Now I have to see Bjorn Ironside as well. That is that is all that script error. Maybe he maybe he wants to get one of my companions to help him out. I'm not sure, but that is that is definitely some old stuff going on there. Um, yeah, I think in the next episode we're gonna go after Cthulhu's. We're gonna take that place. Um, defer the appointment though, because Trevgob already went to the lord of this place. So, I'm gonna defer the appointment and then gonna give uh, Trev Cthulhu's to. One of the old clued lords. I'm gonna keep Cthulhu's for myself. I wanna give that to my father in law. And I'm gonna give Din Bear to Ivor the Boneless. So I do have two of the um, Lothbrok sons around my castle. I would have, I would like to give that to um, Uber Ragnarsson, but I wonder if I can swing that. Has a Rogenwald didn't join me, so he's not gonna get a city. That's just, that's just how this goes. He has, he has made his bed and has to lie in it. That's just how this goes. Um, but yeah, I have to end it here. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, please give me a like. If you didn't, tell me why in the comments so I can improve. And if you want to see more of the series in the future, please consider subscribing so you never miss an episode. I do hope that you join me next time for, yeah, I think the attack on Cthulhu. We do have enough, oh no, we don't have enough money now. <laughs> Thanks to me bringing up my relation with that guy. At least my lords don't hate me. And I'm really happy for the option of paying them some money so that they like me more. That is a huge addition uh, compared to Mount Blade Warband, where you have a lot of problems um, with having a stable kingdom where people actually come to your aid, if you call them. Um, yeah, so I hope you join me for that. Thanks and bye-bye.